we'll just nip up to the counter as normal. Ask them about bailers, see what they've got to lease us. Preferably want a square baler. I prefer square bales. Oh, they've got the nice little John Deere's. It's not going to cost too much to lease. I wonder if we shouldn't just buy it at that price. What, how much does it cost to lease? 600. I will just lease for now. We're a bit short of cash at this point in time. Well, we need to be frugal with cash, let's put it that way. Going to work pretty hard, but because we'll also want to, I think, possibly lease the bale loader, which is going to be. Oh, well, um, do we have? I don't think we have any front loader equipment, do we? No, but I think one of our tractors does have front loader capabilities. Is it this one? Yes, it is this one. So we can get some front loader equipment and just do it that way. Just depends on how many bales we get out of the slot. Right, so here we will use the jump cut and we'll get this back to the to the farm. We'll see you there. Right, we're back at the farm. I am going to go and start with it. And a little bit that we left over from putting into the into the cow barn, just in case I forget. And just while we're here, I need to just stop. Just jump over the fence. Can I get over? It doesn't look like it. Jump. There we go. Got to close the doors. Luckily, nothing escaped, I don't think. Nope, they all look like they're there. Get back into the tractor and continue with the job that we... The job at hand is what I meant to say there. It was just around the corner here, yeah, there was a bit of a... yeah. Get that unfolded, it just folds, unfolds at the back here. Those of you who have been following my series will know that this is one of my favourite balers. Pretty much use it every single time I need a baler. I just can't find anything that's better value. Really, you can't. Um, we we now be lower the pickup and turn the bait on. Just cannot find anything that's better value. It's an older system. Does uh, can I? Two twenty is what we what we've got. It'll be good enough, 220 bales. Right, let's go and get started on the rest. I hope we don't get left with too much in the bale at the end of the baling. It should, it's not going to be a full bale, so it'll be okay. We're already at 20% of this of a bale.
Okay, we're back after that little time lapse. Got these two swaths to do. Then we'll have a look and see how many bales we got. It's not a huge amount. Three, six. Maybe we'll get eight or nine. Three, five, there's another two there, seven. Uh, eight or nine, I'm not sure how many it'll end up being. It's going to be in that vicinity. Right. Turn off the boiler. Load the boiler. Another one, two. And let's. Have a look and see how many we've got. Where do we find that out? It's there, isn't it? Seven. That's slightly less than I thought. It's not too bad though. How much is it in each barrel there? Uh, Seven hundred and fifty six thousand two hundred and fifty litres. Seven sevens are forty nine, so yeah, about fifty thousand, just over fifty thousand liters. So not really to be scoffed at. Do the straw at two forty. That'll be better. I'm not quite sure where we finished off, but this looks like a decent place to start down here. So we've got about half a bale grass in there, which will uh, of hay in there, which will convert to straw, unfortunately. But that cannot be helped. Right, let's get going. We'll get this done as quickly as possible and we'll catch you once the time lapse is done. See you then. you back with me we're just about finished the top field once this is done we'll have a look and see how many we've got then we'll go down and do the bottom field and of course we've got to bring in the bales that we might be working into the evening again tonight there we go that's that done nicely. Just get this to the top here and put them together because we'll have to go and buy ourselves a trailer to take these back to the to pick these all up. It's going to be too many to just up and down it. Let's turn it off. 
and unload. Extra one there. So we had seven of the hay. So let's have a look and see where we are now. We're now on 17. So we've got another 10 there. Right, so we'll mosey on down to the to, to field two and we'll see you once we're there. Field two or the bottom field, whichever way you want to call it. I'm going to call it the bottom field, although it's not strictly at the bottom. that the Bailey is on. There we go. So we were at 17 bales. We'll see where we end up here. I would imagine we'd get pretty much another 10 to 12 here. Though we did take a lot off that other one to put into the um, car barn. So I haven't looked at to see what the different size field is. This just felt smaller than the other one. But it may well just be the same size. We'll see. Let's see how many we get off here. We'll get back onto the time lapse and we'll see you once it's done. Well, you're back with me. Just finishing off the last swath on the bottom field now. And it doesn't look like we're going to be able to bring in the bales. We're losing the light. We do need to have good light to be able to see where, or decent light to be able to see where all the bales are. Otherwise you tend to miss them. It's not too much of a problem because we'll be able to bring those in quite quickly. Also with the jobs that we're going to be doing in October, the planting of the barley and the, um, well, particularly the planting of the barley and the looking after the fields, fix, getting the fields ready. 
we'll be able to use a lot of course play and that type of stuff with that so we'll be able to get a lot of multi actions going there and of course we've got to do the soil analysis first but yeah so we're pretty much losing the light so we're just going to offload this here and I will get the baler back to the store and Got just a just over half a bale that we're going to lose. Get that folded, and yeah, so we will get that back to the store. We will then catch you on the morrow and get the we'll get the planting of the barley done in October. I do hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, please like and subscribe. And we'll catch you in the next one. Cheerio!